Hello and welcome to Crafting, Crafting with Princesses. I'm so excited to see what we're making today. Mm -hmm. Today we're gonna make jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, wow. You know, jack-o'-lanterns originated in the 19th century over in Ireland and Scotland and they were thought to ward off evil spirits. Oh, Ooh. but today we know there's no evil spirits but we all use pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns and are decorating for the holiday season. You can do so many fun things and make a pumpkin that represents you. It can be happy, sad, scary, or your favorite character. It's so much fun. So if you see a pumpkin carved into a jack-o'-lantern on someone's porch, they possibly could be celebrating Halloween. Yeah. And maybe you might want to dress up in your favorite costume and knock, knock, knock and say, trick, trick or treat. And you'll probably get your favorite treat from them. That's one of the best parts of Halloween, in my opinion. Well, now we're gonna tell you all the things you need to make your jack-o'-lantern. Now, of course, these are things you're gonna have to get at home and do with a parent or adult present. But first, you're gonna need a pumpkin. I've got my pumpkin. I got do my you pumpkin. have yours? Now, the next thing you're gonna need is a large carving knife, because you're gonna have to take off the top. And do you know what's inside? Squishy gishy guts and seeds. So you probably want a bowl too to put all the insides in because it can get pretty messy. Right, mm. and it's nice to have one of these handy dandy scoopers to scoop everything out of your pumpkin as well. Now you'll also probably want a Sharpie or some kind of pen or pencil that you can do your own design so you know exactly what you're doing on your pumpkin. Such a great idea. I'm going to do that for mm -hmm. sure. Because if you just start carving with no pattern, who knows what it would look like, right? Oh yeah, mine would look really silly unless I had a guide to help me along. Absolutely. Well, this seems so much fun, but do you think we should get our little friends to help us out? Because I bet they'll have good ideas yes. for jack o -lanterns. That's it's a always, great idea. Absolutely. It's always better to carve with friends. Huh? Uh -huh. Yes. Let's call our friends to come and join us. they look like when we put a candle inside and they're all lit up. I think we should go outside right now and try. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay, let's go. Thank you for watching Princess Perplexity. Make sure to comment on this video, click that like button, and subscribe to our channel. Also, please follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and check out our website, princessperplexity.com. 
If you haven't already, check out all of our previous videos for more princess fun. Thanks for watching.